Hey, welcome back, my name is Alex. I'm a freelance videographer and filmmaker, and it's been a couple days since we looked at some BTS. But today we are taking a look at an ad? Is that what this is? I wanna know the logistics. Like, is this just an ad for them riding around in an Ionic? Is that even a car? <laughs> Regardless, we are taking a look at BTS, Ionic, or I'm on it. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and do that, and let's jump right on into this video. As always, I read the lyrics, but I didn't listen to the song. Very futuristic car. Very, very futuristic. They're again using a Pro Mist filter. Is this filmed by the same people that always film BTS's videos? That's my first question. That is very beautiful. A nice silhouette with all the colors. Everything turning on as you get closer. Slow motion, the drone shots. Okay. Is there just always gonna be lyrics on screen? Yes, there is. Ooh. <laughs> yes, please, the infinite zoom. It looks so good. Oh my God, how are they doing that? I'm assuming because it's BTS, it's a physical set. Like they just made a whole bunch of rooms back to back and it's probably just a crane coming through all of those rooms and actually doing it. If I were to do that, it probably be a lot of compositing and green screen work. I don't know, maybe I should try to do it. I love that opening though. It's like a really nice teaser. I'm a big fan of the purple and the blue too. Okay, some surreal stuff going on. Oh, <laughs> it looks so good. Yes. Is that, I don't know, I'm pausing every two seconds. Is that like trying to say you can see into the future or something? Because that was a very futuristic car and it's like this endless zoom. I didn't really analyze the rooms too much, but I don't know. Ooh, that is very pretty. Oh yes, with the light flares. Yes, it looks gorgeous. I love surreal stuff. Just an office on a rock in the ocean. Oh my god, it looks very beautiful though. There's some nice drone shots to go with it. Is that supposed to be the ocean? No, that's sand. Okay. Ooh, what is on the ceiling? Is that supposed to be in the ocean? So you got like sand at the bottom and then the waves at the top? Is that what it is? Everything is randomly floating, which is cool. The way that they do it at least because they attach it in ways that you don't realize that it's attached. Probably like that lamp or that stool over there. They're using Dutch angles or they're just like tilting the camera a lot to get that like surreal dreamy kind of a feel. Earlier I said they had a pro mist, which you could definitely see right there. I'm sorry, I'm pausing a lot, but every couple of frames is just something so beautiful. So they have a pro mist filter, which really adds to the dreaminess of everything because what it does is it blooms the highlights. This is a pro mist filter and you can see that the light on the phone gets a lot bigger. My pro mist filters aren't that powerful, but if you use a powerful pro mist filter, it gives you that real dreamy look. So you can see his hand, the light on top of his head, they're, they're blooming. It's like real dreamy, pretty. And really, really pretty. <laughs> Ooh. I love the camera room and it's so like fluent and floaty. Ooh. Okay, more sand. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Sunset. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I like that they like previewed all of these sets at the beginning. Like we saw this light beam, like he's about to be abducted. Oh my God, it looks so good. The water moving too. Yes, please. I love the water. The water really sells it for me. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. I wonder how much is real and how much is not. You know? Ooh. Ooh. 
like, okay. I thought it was just gonna be the floor and that's it. That's such a cool shot whenever you can get it. Having like two perspectives inside of the same shot at once. And the clouds, are they actually outside with this? Do they, do they put a whole bunch of mirrors outside? The mirrors look crazy. Oh. I like that a lot. They built a studio or at least a performance room outdoors in a glass box. But that wall, that interesting pattern is acoustic foam. It looks really intense too. Like if you've ever seen the videos of the most quiet room on earth, it's very similar. I don't know. The fact that he's in a box is just really nice. He's like doing his thing, watching the outside world change around him. Ooh, yes. Having stuff in the foreground. <laughs> wow, this video is so beautiful. Oh, I love that you can just see how much fun they're already having. <laughs> yes. Okay, so that room is most definitely like a physical set, obviously, with BTS, why wouldn't it be? So yeah, they built a whole bunch of rooms and then they probably just have this gigantic crane coming through all of them. Those shots are so cool. When I was doing music videos, I started doing something very similar. You can put your gimbal into vortex mode where the whole camera rotates over one of the axes so you can like spin it like that as you're walking forward. Oh, so yeah, that's definitely like a vortex mode. They're like dancing on top of tables and stuff. <laughs> oh, the beauty shots. Yes. I am here for it. And then they turn off the lights again. It's a nice full circle. Of course, we gotta have the car. Oh my God. God, ah, they did one with Boston Dynamics. This is definitely a contender to my favorite BTS videos. Like the visuals, like this one was just so, so beautiful. Oh my God. I wanna give a big thank you to all my Patreon supporters, specifically Elizabeth, Jemmy, Kimberly, Lisa, Lucas, Melissa, Miss Heiju, and Victoria. If you wanna support the channel, go ahead and check the links in the description below. If you are not already subscribed, go ahead and do that. And all right, all right.